So you are hosting Thanksgiving at your home and uh, you're thinking of all the elements and all the ideas on what you're going to do for your Thanksgiving feast and one of them might be wondering, do I need to do a toast or how do I uh, give a toast at Thanksgiving? Well, my name is Lori Randall with Simply Divine Events and I'm going to tell you how to give a Thanksgiving toast. Um, what you're going to want to do is first make sure that all the guests are there before you make your toast. Make sure that everyone's you know, seated and um, at their place. And you don't want to give your toast right in the middle of, like, say, a course, a meal. You might want to do it before or maybe once you kind of like in into the meal and you know that everyone's just there and ready to go. Um, if there's a large group, you're going to want to stand up when you give your toast. Um, want to make sure that everyone has champagne and, um, and a, a champagne glass. Um, if, they don't, if you don't have a lot of champagne glasses, that's fine. Just make sure that everyone does have a drink in their hand. And it is kind of nice to have, you know, a glass of champagne as well. Um, and then if it's um, a small intimate group, you know, there's no need to stand up. But you're going to want to think about what you're going to say for your toast. Um, maybe make it personal. Maybe go around and, you know, say everything that you're thankful. If you have a small gathering, you know, you're thankful for your family and your friends. And, um, you know, just kind of let everyone know that how, you know, glad that you are that they all came together for Thanksgiving. So um, just keep it nice and, you know, simple, but, you know, intimate as well and personal. So those are some ideas on how to um, give a Thanksgiving toast.